Hello everybody! In this video I will show you an easy trick how to figure out the polarity of any magnet without the use of a compass or a polarity finder. So what you see here is just a stack of two neodymium disc magnets. These are quite strong and 52 magnets but it doesn't matter, they can be weaker and you will still find it out with this trick quite easily. So basically what you do is you take the magnets like this and as you can already see um, if the surface they're laying on is flat enough this is just a regular floor it's not really perfectly flat but still flat enough the magnets will automatically align always with the magnetic field of earth and as you can see they always go to the same position so in this direction is the north pole or the magnetic south pole of earth so you probably know where north is where you live and by this you can easily determine the polarity of a magnet because this direction is north meaning the magnetic south pole of earth which means this side of the magnet must be north pole and this side must be south pole. You can also do this with another magnet. Here I have just another neodymium ring magnet. This is an N42 one. It works just fine with this also. If you take it, you can see it always aligns like this. And I can show you this with a compass that I have here. And you can see it aligns in the same direction. And since I've been asked some questions about this compass and how it works, this is not um, the common type of compass where you look at it from the top. So north is not in this direction, but in this direction where the arrow is pointing. So this is a car compass. You don't look at it from the top, but from the side. This is also why this half is open here on this side and not on the whole surface from looking from the top. So basically the magnet that's inside the compass, the south pole of the magnet is where north is marked. And if you stand here and look at it from the side and north is pointing towards you, towards you where you look at it, you are looking, like it is marked with the arrow, you are looking towards north or the um, south magnetic pole of earth. So with a regular compass where you look at it from the top, it's exactly the inverse. Then here would be south marked and here would be north marked. But yeah, this is just to clear up some confusions that I got asked in videos. And to show this to you, we know that north is pointing in this direction. So here we have north pole and here we have south pole geographically. And now I will take this magnet just like this and you can see how it aligns. So here is our magnetic south pole, uh, excuse me, north pole, because it is pointing towards north or the magnetic south pole of Earth. And if this is north pole, you can see with this compass it attracts north or where nor north is marked, because here in this compass the magnetic south pole of the magnet is here where north is marked. I will show you this again. Just flip the magnet. And as you can see it realigns always. Well not always because the surface is not perfectly flat. But most of the time it will realign like this. So we have North Pole here and with the compass 
with this one it's quite easy to determine because you don't have to think inverse so always north is north and if I flip the magnet south is south so basically this compass or this type of compass shows you directly where south or north is pointing also south or north pole is on the magnet so yeah this is just an easy trick that I wanted to show you and also if you take this magnet or an even bigger one just like this ring magnet you will notice that there is a slight force coming from Earth's magnetic field that yeah, basically turns the magnet always in the same direction, obviously. And this means also that if you take this magnet in your hand and just um, rotate it around its own axis, just like a gyroscope would, just imagine the center point of the magnet would be fixed somewhere on a pivot point and you just rotate it like this with a slight tilt you can probably feel a slight momentum that works against your rotation movement when you do this this is kind of the same force that is acting on yeah, the magnet when it gets aligned when you do this motion and yeah you can also feel this force that is aligning the magnet with Earth's magnetic field quite strong I mean not really that strong but as strong as you can see here it overcomes the weight of the magnet and yeah you can feel it the strongest when you tilt it and rotate it like this. If you take an even bigger stack of magnets or a bigger magnet itself, you can feel it even stronger. And I think this is quite interesting if you have never tried this before. So anyways, I just wanted to make this video because I got asked a lot on how this compass works and if I got the polarity correct if I use it to find out the polarity of a magnet. So I just wanted to show you this one and also how you can easily determine the polarity of any magnet by just putting it on a flat plane and let go of it. You will see that it will always align with Earth's magnetic field and therefore you can easily determine the polarity of any magnet and also if you're not sure what type of compass you have or if you got it correct with the polarity finding just use this trick it will always work so yeah thanks for watching and goodbye